Hello, and welcome to another episode of Zeke using a computer and doing AI stuff, um, and hopefully showing you something useful. So this is going to be a short one. I just recorded a video about this flux model, um, and I'm using OBS to record the video, uh, which is this open source software that lets you kind of like compose a webcam and do screen recording and mic input and stuff like that. Um, but it saves files in this MKV format. And actually, maybe I should just see if there's a way to configure OBS to do a different format. But anyway, I already did the recording and I have this MKV file and I want to put it on Twitter, I want to put it on YouTube, blah, blah, blah. But it, that's the wrong format for those things. So I need to convert it. So I know there's this tool called FFmpeg and if you've ever used FFmpeg, it's like, let's actually just like look at the man page for FFmpeg. Uh, it's pretty scary. Like, look at all those flags. What do those things do? If we do man ffmpeg. Oh my god. It's crazy. It's so much. So the, the thing you used to do if you wanted to use ffmpeg is like Google, how do I convert a video to blah, blah, blah. And then you would end up on a Stack Overflow page and copy something. We don't have to do that stuff anymore. So... Um, I have a command line tool called YOLO X, which um, sends a command that you type in the terminal to a language model and asks it to convert it to a one-liner to run in, in your shell. So let's try using it. Um, all you need to do to use it is install Node.js, and then you can do um, npx YOLO X and then an English language command. So I'm gonna say, um, uh, take uh, flux schnell versus dev mkv and save it as flux schnell versus dev mp4 um, using ffmpeg. Preserve the audio and use the fastest possible method. So I, I, I typed th these extra things because sometimes when you use an FFmpeg command, it just drops the audio. So let's see what happens. Let's see if this works. Um, so by default, it uses um, GPT-4 to do um, to generate the command, you can also use llama on replicate. So what did it generate? It generated this command, uh, which I don't know, maybe that works. Um, and it, it ran pretty quickly. And now I see we have an MP4 file um, here on my desktop. And if I open it up, hey party people, I just want to do a quick one about, it looks like it worked. So um, success, YOLO worked on the first try, which is the way you want it to be. Um, and just to expound on YOLO a little bit, you can use it for all sorts of things. Like if I didn't like the first one second uh, of this video clip, like maybe it took me a minute to start talking, um, I could give it a command like extract from zero colon 30 to 122. I could have said chop off the first five seconds of video and save it as video chopped.mp4. So, um, this kind of opens up a whole new, a whole new world of being able to use uh, tools like FFmpeg and Image Magic and things like that without ever having to look anything up. So, uh, great use of AI, super productive. That's it. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye bye. I'm gonna press the stop button now. There it is. Bye.